while, guys, but we're gonna go pick up someone special. Let's go. Had an excuse to bring out the GTR for the first time in a long time. And it's because today's a special day. Someone has arrived and we're gonna go pick them up from the airport. You didn't tell him who it was? No, I never mentioned oh. anything about it's him Jordan. here. It's Jordan. Shut up! <laughs> Where are you? Oh, he's right there. Where? I see him. Where? I freaking see he's him. on the wrong side. I'm, I'm, the I'm on the wrong side. The Is this gonna fit? That's not gonna fit. Oh my gosh, I'm going home. It's not supposed to be in this lane. What's up, guys? Robbie, I thought you were leaving today. Look who it is. What's up? Come here. Bro, you got freaking eyes. I stayed longer just so I could see you. I, yeah, I, I, Rob I, I, extended his trip so he could see Jordan. Yeah. How long? For another month. How long, How long are you here till? Forever. <laughs> He's moving in, baby. Because I'm too busy and I can't edit anymore. So I told Jordan, just move in, dude. Just move in. So this is the problem we're having. I brought the wrong car. <laughs> One can go on the passenger seat. Take the bus home, Rob. Alright, I'll get on the subway. <laughs> there we go, we got one. Now we gotta get the other one, but I don't think the seats can recline, so we're freaking on. Are you alright? So you came here with two big luggages and you're moving here. Oh, get in, get in. We're in the wrong parking. Like Sick. <laughs> <laughs> we got I, I need help. We got chased out by the bus. <laughs> in case you guys didn't know, this is how you gotta adjust it. It's so hard. It takes so long. Oh, there's another car behind us. Oh, too. Jesus Christ. Move. Oh, oh make it look exhausted. Exhausted. You got you room? Good back there? Yeah, man. You got room? All right, we are out. Let's room? go home, baby. What is this? Switch over to the 360 cam. So before we get into today's video, I have been lagging on new content. All the content you guys have been seeing have been from like a couple weeks ago. So I'm trying to get caught up. We have Jordan now. He's killing it. He's in the room editing this video, but we're getting caught up. The house is looking pretty blown out considering the house is fully packed right now. And I barely drive these things. I probably shouldn't be buying another car right now, but I did want to show you guys something. There's this new express delivery for car purchases. And I bought a car this morning. So you got the car right here. And you just click, and there it is. Express delivery. It's that easy, guys. Okay, maybe it's not that easy, but when you have a Jordan over there, it makes things a lot easier. But it can be as simple as this. If you guys hit us up at Barron's Garage, we can totally find you an R34, any car of your dreams, and have it delivered to your front door. Yes, we offer that service. This one will be for sale on Barron's Garage. It's the R34 GT, so it's a non-turbo, but it still has the RB25. It is a manual, and the thing is clean. It's pretty much all original at the moment. We do offer services to slam it, put some wheels on it, put a kit on it if we have to. Who doesn't want an all original R34 GT? Prices are kind of outrageous right now. So GTT, which is the turbo model, is gonna run you anywhere from 45 to 55, $65,000, which is pretty outrageous. Or you can get a coupe like this one, 29,999. You can save a lot of money if you wanna put a turbo on yourself. Like I mentioned before, it's still RB25, so you can do that. A lot of these base model 34s come with basic single cam, six cylinders. You got the dual cam RB25 in there and you get to save like $20,000. So hit us up there on Barron's Garage if you guys want this car. Obviously it's a 25 year old car. We still have about, I think six more months or something till it's eligible for import. But we do offer storage for this thing. Condition wise, let's see. I mean, the paint is original, so some parts of the car are faded. As you can see, there is some scratches, maybe due to the skinny roads here in Japan and like dragging plants, trying to get past cars. 
Headlights are a little bit sun faded. This one looks like it got into a little fender bendy, but nothing too serious. It does have a little bit of surface rust here on the core support. Obviously, I will provide you detailed pictures and videos if you guys are interested in this car. We're not gonna get too much into it right now for the video, but if you guys are interested, just shoot us a DM and we can get this sorted out for you. Thanks for making it that easy for me, Jordan. Let's park this thing up on the side of the house. Like a dream, baby. Interior's nice. It's your radio, AC. 184,000 kilometers, which is maybe 100,000 miles, which is not bad at all for the NARB25. These things will probably last forever. There we go. As you can see, it is aging on the shift knob and the steering wheel, but that's like the first thing you change when you buy a car. If you're a car dude, besides that, pretty minty boys, and besides fading. But that's why 30 grand can get you the R34 in similar condition. I would say that's sort of the market right now, but that looks good. Neighbors always wonder why I have so many different cars in front of my house. Always play musical cars around here. Everyone's pretty cool for the most part though. We'll get back to today's video. I just wanted to give it a little update on where we are right now. Life's good, baby. Hello, beautiful. Hello, micro. Ah! We're taking the 180 today. Where to? Find out, baby. people are here jeez put your window down and say hi to people Bob. oh we just watched the car it's okay i'm leaving the windows down i got anxiety i think we're gonna be here for like four hours we're doing a photo shoot for my boy lucas i have no idea what we're getting into but this is my first time driving a cool car in the city we drove an hour here that's the farthest i ever drove this thing or i did drive it to kodas but not fully painted and nice clenching butt cheeks the entire way this is not the car there it is all right, we're gonna reenact the Fast and Furious clip. Oh, what happened? Oh, I'm just gonna drift. Yeah, you gotta get chased by Yakuza. It's so loud. Right, shut up, phone. train. This train's freaking hating on us. I don't know the plan. I think we're just gonna post up. I'll keep you updated here in a second. This car is way too low, guys. I already messed up my front bumper, I'm pretty sure. How cool is this? <laughs> Look where we are. We're posted up on the side street. Car is parked up. I'm about to get hit. Mama chicken with a baby chicken. Fire. It's okay. It's all right. It's, like, it's, it's a 10 out of 10 for me. I love it's it. It's kind of fun. <laughs> Gonna make a business out of this? Mm-hmm. Look how cool this is. This lighting. I don't know where to go. We're just waiting for the homies. They're pulling up with the cameras and stuff, so. We're gonna find a place to shoot right now. Oh, the go-karts is lit. Hey. Coda's looking good. Back Coda, Coda's car. What's up, sexy? What's up? You made it. Yeah. <laughs> Bumper's still alive. Hood, I don't know what's going on there. This is crazy, this looks sick. It's so good. Behind the scenes, the cars look amazing. This guy. What do they say nowadays? Huh? Mid. <laughs> I love how they just do what they want. Literally just shutting the street down. Check out the next spot. 
Lucas knows all the good spots. Skyline in the back. Skyline in the front. I don't need to in to get some love. This thing's just been sitting. It's my second time driving. Stoked. That's a wrap. 40 minutes home. Do you have fun? Sorry we dragged you along that photo shoot. That was sick, dude. That was cool. I appreciate everyone who came out and said, what's up? Took pictures and stuff. So random, just hanging out on the sidewalk of Shibuya and people coming up saying they watch the vlogs. That's tight, because I'm in Japan. Super random. Probably didn't even film that much, but I'm just gonna throw this in the vlog. Hey. Hello, oh, I'm Rob. Hello, my name is Toto. Hello, my name is Toto. doing boys today whatever rob's heart desires rob's last day we are in the mountains of chiba he wants to touch nature he wants to feel nature up i guess so i'm gonna go put my hands in nature that's what we're gonna do it's something i don't really care to do we're going hiking yeah and we're pulling up soon cut us already here you're gonna get me copyrighted with that beautiful voice of yours oh, my bad. Chill. I'm sorry. Anyways, this place is pretty tight. Where are we going, boys? Masuga. We're out at the poop in nature. That's all I recorded. <laughs> in the country, country. Now, people live here. It seems pretty cool. You got cool views, man. Look at the views. I think that's what it is. People who don't care about being in the city. Ew, it's like we're in Hawaii again. Love it. This is cool. B roll. And you gotta do the turning of the car. Oh, look how fast it looks we're going. Pulling up. So apparently you can just drive up the hike. I'm I'm kind of leaning more towards that. You know what I'm saying? I don't see you, Kona. What are we doing? I don't see you. Where am I going? Kona, where are you? Kona. Hey, where you at, bro? I don't, there was a parking lot at. I don't see you. I sent you guys. Uh, we're here. We're, we're, we're here. We're, yeah, I'm at you. We're here. I sent. I tapped here. <laughs> he tapped you, bro. He I tapped, tapped it. That, bro. All right, we're coming. We're coming, Kona. Yeah, I'm coming, coming so, quick. I'm coming so I'm hard. I'm recording. Dude. Shut up. There's nobody here. The legend of the Tengu. Red nose guy that comes and steals your kids. I was trying to look up what animals are up here so it makes sure we don't die. Hey, they got full toge up here, man. We it's made the it. Parking lot. Oh, oh there's the Yoda. Van, van. And it's Arufado. Arufado. Hey, buddy. Hey. Hey, Nino. Hi. Jordan. Hey, you should, do. you should put that in between your butt cheeks <laughs> and then you just punch your butt cheeks really hard. Can you just PG for one minute? <laughs> all right, just one minute. That's I've, all been I here, ask. I've been here for three weeks and you can only put me in the vlog for like two seconds. No one even knows what your voice sounds like. <laughs> it's just barking dogs. <laughs> that footage is cool. Oh, can you mix some of that in here? Yes, sir. You guys can get a little view of you got that. a lot. We're ready. Check it out. I don't hike rock. at all. I got skating shoes. Hey, bro, you're Sleeping better prepared shorts. than me and Rob. I'm yeah. prepared, but I'm going to be in solidarity with Jordan. <laughs> I'm just going to go barefoot. Are we good? Come on. We're good to go? We're right. good. Let's head up the mountain. What is this? It's like an amusement park hike. Oh, we pay here. size of this street light. Did you guys know how big a street light was? Because I didn't. That thing's huge. I, mean, I guess it makes sense. Anyways, I guess this hike is like not even really a hike. It's just a pathway. Start seeing some cool stuff soon. Just a lot of steps. You gotta run up it, dude. Dang, Jordan's in sport mode with the Crocs right now. Gotta go up the ramp. 200 years old? Yeah, I think it's very old. It's been here since 1742, it says. Oh, there's a little waterfall here. Mr. Hunter, I'm just splashing on myself.
We gotta go over here. It's like a little cliff. This is pretty cool right here. There's a fat line over there. Oh. All right. <laughs> if Rob can make it up there. Jordan's there. This is, oh my god, this is scary. That's where we just were. This is hey. Rob's idea. He wants to shotgun some tea. That's my house is over there. Oh, I see it. It's right there. Oh, I see the shop. I took the ferry. We're doing it for the boys. One, two, three. That was freaking lame. <laughs> <laughs> Well, that's it. We're going back down, but I think we're gonna find a place to eat. What, what, what? What's happening? A bee nest, a yeah. harness. Oh my gosh, that's a lot of bees. He's gonna go in. Oh, he's gonna go in? Is that the queen? Yeah, yeah, they're battling. All well, the mini ones gonna ah! attack him. Like, hundred of them. Hey, how do you... What are you, seeing the animal planet? Battle of the bees right now. Check it out, this is crazy. Why are you sweating so much, bro? <laughs> up here you're a pescatarian right it's sick i like sausage <laughs> well, this place has so much food i think we were just on top of one of these mountains yeah yeah we were right up the there she just said i want that oh this place looks pretty cool i'm so hungry oh Jordan's first time eating a raw egg <laughs> it's just the yolk it's just the yolk the negitoro Honey, which is we keep it rare. We take everything. And she does it. Bye. I'll see you next month. Vlogception. <laughs> Bye, Jordan. I just I just saw you. you Bye. I'll see you tomorrow. I'm going to Cali I'm with I'm Rob. Gonna swim. I'm gonna swim back that way. Bye. Bye. Have fun. On the ferry home. And where are you going? Back. Oh, you're just gonna swim back? <laughs> okay, see you later, Rob. Now we're going to Narita Temple. Let's go. Back at the airport. We're not picking up anyone because Rob's going home. I don't want to go back, man. You don't have to. We're gonna make him miss his flight. Well, we didn't end up going to the temple because we got way too tired after that oh, fake yeah. hike. <laughs> Touristing for three weeks is hard. Probably. Look at this guy. Just the backpack on his back. Three weeks here. I had to ball Josh's socks and underwear. He's still wearing my underwear and socks right now. I'm keeping them. <laughs> this is how I'm gonna remember you when I'm back in the state. <laughs> this is like the worst walk. So it's so much fun when you come out <clears throat> and the airport sucks leave. And it's 13 hours worth of traveling. Jeez. It's okay, Everybody come back. Coughing, kids crying. <laughs> Freaking can't poop when you land because your stomach's all weird. <laughs> Can't poop for like five days. <laughs> Gotta go to the hospital. <laughs> it's all part of the trip, man. It's all part of the experience. <laughs> oh man, last place in Japan. <laughs> McDonald's. <laughs> <laughs> Going home to America. <laughs> Gotta try McDonald's. You didn't try it yet. No. Hasn't tried McDonald's in Japan. It is a must. <laughs> Look at that. What'd you get? Shrimp nuggets. What? Shrimp nuggets? They make they make shrimp nuggets. They have spicy chicken sandwich, french fries, a melon float, and Jordan got a strawberry shake. This is fire, Oh, Nico's here, by the way. Hey, Nico. He took the train here just to say bye to Rob. What a good man. Whoa. He's coming back I like to your America. style. I'm man. He's coming back to Cali. Yeah, he is. San Francisco. <laughs> I'm going. In the, in the, in the. <laughs> Dang, you guys are killing us. I was just trying not to cry right now. Super shy. Super shy. <laughs> Super cry. Super cry. <laughs> 
Come back soon, buddy. See you, buddy. Bye, Bobby. Bobby. So sad. Bye bye. Wasn't gonna film, but I'm bringing Jordan to the best curry in Japan. Gogo's curry. We're in Shinjuku. We haven't been here in so long. I'm so excited. Why are you putting your hand over your face in this? Because I don't want you to shade. see my face. <laughs> Anyways, this place is our favorite. There's nobody in here. They don't know what's going on. So I'm talking about Jordan. The challenge. The challenge. Two katsu, shrimp, four sausage, egg. Can you do it? Nah. Jordan wanted to go to Coco's, but I told him Go-Go's. Is M pretty normal? I think it's medium. <laughs> you don't say. Right, Leah. <laughs> you don't say. I, uh, I, never, I never knew what M stood for. Pretty sure it means medium, maybe. Medium? I'm not gonna... Right. Oh. Hey, can you take your jacket she, off? You're making me uncomfortable. Bro, this is how the Akatsuki dress. Oh, okay. I want your first reaction. It's black curry. So far, not a good reaction. It's meant. Free fire? Mm -hmm. Yes. You love it, huh? Yeah, I love this. I love it. Reminds me of high school. Yeah, apparently Gogo's is originally from Leah's high school hometown. So she used to eat this in high school. And now it's all over Tokyo. So that's pretty cool. Anyways, if you're in Tokyo, this is 10 out of 10. Check it out. Leah wanted to come here. I have no idea what this is, but we're in a mall. Look at this place. Oh, hello. Oh, look, it's a trash statue. What is this place? Oh, it is a game center. These lights are crazy. I don't want to play games. Hey, dude, double fillage. I thought it was going to be bigger. I think I think that section is it. That's it? Yeah, that's There's it. There's no neon lights there. That, that is the, this, is all... this is neon. Down there was like traditional Japanese izakaya style. You can get sick B-roll. Just that. But all right, downstairs... sick B-roll. Here we go. Anyways, that's that. And I hope you enjoyed the little B-roll. I just want to know what this is. That is the real question here. What is going on? Can you explain this? Work of a building made by cutting out its three floors and stacking them together with residual materials from each floor. I think they failed. What? They're like, let's see how many people are going to be fooled by this trash, literally. It's a fridge door with like mold on it. I mean, I guess what? Trust me, I'm just as confused. If you know what's going on here, comment down below. I have no idea. Gomi sandwichi. I like that, Jordan. <laughs> Anyways, I don't think we're gonna stop here. We're gonna keep moving. Stupid foreigners. We're the only ones without umbrellas here. Seems like it's kind of rainy. We're trying to find Godzilla. There's like a Godzilla statue. I have no idea where it is. We're on the hunt in the rain. This is ridiculous. Pretty cool though. It's Shinjuku Nights. It's your first time here, huh? No, I went when I had my layover. Oh, you had a layover. So Jordan's actually never been to Japan. He's only been here for 23 hours on a layover. I got a JR, got a JR pass. pass for the 20, 24 hours. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, we're just exploring, but we look stupid with no umbrellas, Jordan. <laughs> Everyone has an umbrella. I have a bucket hat, so I guess I'm kind of okay. Yeah, so we found it and it's literally right there. Bro. Thing is soaking up right. <laughs> soaking wet. Alright, we're gonna walk all the way over here to get a better look at Godzilla. There he is. There it is, Jordan. <laughs> what, this is what I live for. Uh, what? <laughs> can you zoom in on it? My camera doesn't zoom in enough. Can I zoom in on your okay. zoom in? I gotta zoom in on Jordan's zoom in. Oh dude, we're double zooming right now. Look how close we can get. Oh, dude, we're super close. <laughs> sick. That was sick, guys. We freaking saw Godzilla. You look so stoked, man. Yeah, I want to 
want to take a picture for Jordan. Make sure he's there. They freaking turned him off. Sorry, Jordan. Did you get at least one or not really? I mean, you were the photographer, babe, so <laughs> did you get at least one? <laughs> it was so um, hard with that Jordan, many people. you're not there. That's me right there, bro. <laughs> oh, you turned into a Korean actor. Nice. <laughs> All right, where to next? This is where we ended up, because Jordan is a professional table tennis player. So it's Jordan against Lee, and I'll be keeping score. You guys ready? There you go. There. <laughs> Give me a proper serve, Jordan. Oh, so proper. We can cut that, don't worry. Dude, you just shook her up, dude. She has no idea what's going on. <laughs> just hesitating. Wait, I want to I show you guys my um, proper serve. Okay, proper, proper serve. All right, praying at the temple. And serve. <laughs> yeah, I see it. Do you see it? I don't think you can see it. <laughs> Look at that ball. <laughs> I did it. <laughs> That's it. We're calling in a night. First night in Japan. Sickness. Not really first night. First night in the city. Yeah. Success. Now, pay this expensive parking, baby. Let's go. Here's the underground parking, and they have a car elevator. Oh, All right, so there's a little turntable disc thing here, and you get on a car elevator. How cool is that? All right, this is tight. Push this button. I'm going to twist you around, OK? Watch out, though. Okay, you guys ready? Let's go. <laughs> That's freaking sick. Can we do this like two times? Why do they let us play with this stuff? This is dangerous. Okay, and then how to use? Press the boom button. Don't touch another button. <laughs> how sick is this? All right, I think I should get in the car now. Boom, car elevator. Gotta love Japan. Mochotto, forward. Hi. Okay. It's closing and we're going up. Have you ever been on one of these? No, it's the first time. I've never been on one of I these. Have. have you? You have? Yeah. Oh yeah. I've lived in one of these before. It feels so weird. We're going up right now. You guys can't feel it, but it feels weird. Check it out. Oh yeah. So we pull up on the turntable right here. Okay. That's small. All right. Yeah. Turntables, baby. Gotta love Japan. Anyway, success. 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 Go eat it, go ghost. That was the whole moral of this. That was the whole moral. Can I say this? That was the whole moral of the story. You gotta eat go ghost kare. Go go kare. Go go kare. Kare kare. Kare shi ga Simasen, Kareshi ga Karim. Eh? Is there a gun? <laughs>